got this for you, man. I got this for you. Me? <laughs> I'm okay, bro. I am. But she's not. Well, I just came out from a great conquest. No, I never know. I mean, let me go check my hand. Who knows where the hand has been? <laughs> but really, yeah, my hand has been into a lot of places and out. You know what I'm talking about? I've been the lost one. You know, like. <laughs> Look, Francis, I'm not asking you to stop sharing your road with the whole world or plowing all the fuels you want to plow. Well, at least, can you stop doing it in my house? Yeah, I could, but you know, I don't want these girls coming to my house feeling like they can come anytime they want and all that. You know how these girls behave when they get good stuff? You know I don't what know. I'm talking about? You know. I don't know. You know, bro. I don't, you know. don't know. Just please stop doing it in my house. The next time it happens, I'll take my keys from you and I'm serious. Okay, fine. No problem. But my brother's house is my house, bro. I'm not your brother, You're Francis. My brother. I am not your brother. You're my brother. Go and get the life. You're my brother. And you love me. I don't love you. You love me, bro. <laughs> Did you love me? Oh, come on, go carry me to work, bro. Take me to work. <laughs> your face. Yo, you're bad. <laughs> you are bad. Mama. You know that I don't have a job yet. Look, I'm actually about to go for an interview right now. <sighs> Listen, Mama, all I need is your prayers, okay? Please. Look, I understand what is going on, okay? And I'm doing the best that I can. Okay, all right. Love you. Talk to you later, okay? I'm late. Mama, please try and understand my situation now, please. That was the last 20k I had on me. You guys should just manage it like that. Okay, I'm going to send more to you guys soon, okay? Alright. The mother again? Yeah. <sighs> Sorry. So how was the interview? Darling, same old story. I'll get back to you. Oh, my baby, I'm so sorry. Wait, hold on. What are you sorry about? They might actually get back to me this time around. Okay, okay. that's the spirit. <laughs> uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. It's like you have a speech prepared for every scenario, Abby. Maybe. Ah, so don't silly. worry. On hmm, on Friday, mm -hmm. I'll take you out. Let's go and have fun the way we used to. Uh, 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 I would really love that. I can't wait for us to do that. But first things first, is there food in the house? Because look, I want to faint. Babes, I'm hungry. Am I your maid? I want to eat. If I go downstairs and take food for yourself. Babe. Oh. Hey, yes. You play this. Then it's yeah. mine. <laughs> <laughs> That's how to play the game, boy. Ah, Pops, I see your hands are getting stronger. Ah, uh, the student can never be better than the teacher, you know. Already? Because I let you win. I've humiliated you all day. I just decided to call it a night. Pride goes before a fall, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. You came for more? No, no, thanks. Okay. So, <sighs> how is your friend doing? Uh, Francis is doing okay. Just frustrating my life, like usual. What has he done this time? Francis has turned my house to a brothel. Although I keep telling him to stop, he doesn't listen. If I didn't see how much you tried, I would have been asking where his parents went wrong. I know. I know what you mean. I, I wish you were my son instead. But I am your son. And I love you. I love you too, kids. Just that I, I, I worry about Francis' lifestyle, you know. Cutting him off, I thought I, it would make him think. I discovered that that didn't even shake him. I can't imagine how you feel. But I believe he's going to change. I mean, he has to because he's no longer a child. Are you talking to him, like advising him? You talk to him every day? Yes, I, I talk to him every day. I advise him, but... It's like I can't reach him. I just feel like right now you should just pray for him and hopefully he changes. <sighs> oh. Dad, 
has gone now. You want to make an old man cry now. <laughs> I beg, you don't start today. <laughs> Take care of yourself, okay? Okay. <sighs> my keys. I'm sorry now. Calm down. Relax now. Chill. Let's know if you follow you play again. Calm down now. Which can I play with that? Why? <laughs> <laughs> you made, you made, you <laughs> What's funny? God, you look at all with your slippers and you're like, I'm armed. Bro, man, what are you going to do with this? Francis, which kind of life are you living? See, I love you and I will always be there for you. But you need to grow up now. Well, bro, I'm trying. How are you trying? This is your lifestyle of dropping from club to club and switching girls like you change your clothes. Is that one trying? You can't do better now. So your baby, you don't do old, though. Well, Mr. Perfect, look at how easy it was for you to say. I'm not Mr. Perfect. Neither am I asking you to be. But you can't do better for yourself. Mm. Even Pop starts cutting you off with help or something. I beg, mean, Philip, leave that old man out of this, all right? But he thinks cutting me off will make me crawl back to him. Well, jokes on him. No, jokes on you. Because if I cut you off, who will you run to? <laughs> if you cut me off, I'll go back to you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm thirsty. Man. Let me drink this one in peace, man. Don't tell me. Am I worried to talk to you? What? The way you are looking at me. I wasn't sizing you up if that's what you mean. You weren't? No. That's okay. Hey, I'm Francis. Angel, nice to meet you. My pleasure. So what's a beautiful lady doing here all alone? Well, my friend stood me up. She chose a he over a she, so yeah. So why don't you follow a he as well? Excuse you? I mean, the friend is out there with a man. What's stopping you from following another man? Do I look like that kind of girl to you? You know what they say? Show me your friend and I'll tell you who you are. You're mad. Who the hell do you think you are? I won't give you the right to make such insinuations about me. Oh. The man my friend is with is her fiancé, if you must know. You're thirsty. And you're rude. I'm rude? Alright, uh, I'm sorry, I just assumed. Well, you better stop assuming. 
And for your information, I could get any man I want. I just want to drink in peace. What if I say you can't? Get lost. Hundred cases you can't. Do I look like I need a hundred K to you? Five hundred cases you can't. And I get him to go on a date with me? Hell no. All the way. For 500k, he must be mad. <laughs> One million. 300k up front. Guy, you know I need this money, yeah? They don't have told me to fix soap. That's what I'm trying to do, man. I need capital to start now. I was like, give you two million naira three weeks ago. For a business that I haven't seen till now. I told you I got duped. Are we going over this again? Exactly. What's the assurance that you're not going to get duped again? Listen, this time around, yeah, I did my research. I made sure everything was, you know, was good. This is legit, man. But you know, you know, normally, you know, say I got this so on a normal day. You know, say I do feel one now. You know that that cut me off or something. And whose fault is that? Yeah, it's it's my fault. So we're not doing this this time. Bro. Okay, fine. If you don't have the money to give me right now, are you helping me talk to dad? I mean, tell him to give me this money. Man. Bro, I will shock you. This business will boom. Trust me. I beg now. Okay. All right, man. I will. Thanks. Hey, Filipino, my nigga. Thanks. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on. The boy is down now. I need some day, man. <laughs> All right, I got you. All right, bro. You're the best, man. Bro, I'm sorry, okay? I'll be back real quick, all right? But by the kind you ready this food station plate. And this is the only food station that is selling right now. All right, just give me like, give me like 10, 15 minutes. I'll be back, yeah? Okay. Hello. Hey. Come in. So I trusted you with my money. And you can't even trust me with your address. I stay with my mom, so you can't come to my house. Sorry. Oh, uh, let's say we're trying to make sure I can find you. You are literally on my street and I won't lose. Yeah. Everything you need to find him. Angel, listen. We have just five days. Alright? And I have one group. You cannot at any point use me to get advantage. You don't know me. You've not met me. Am I understood? What about my balance? And what do I get if you lose? <sighs> Alright, listen. I give you my word, yeah? Once this is done, you get your balance. And if you lose, you can get to keep the 300k for your effort. So what do you stand to gain in all this? The satisfaction of seeing you lose. 
<laughs> Do have a nice day, Angel. Hey girl. Hey baby. What's up now? No, I'm fine now. How are you? Ah, dear. Ah, who is this? My dear, that guy was not joking. What guy? The 300k guy I was telling you about now. Ooh. And this right here is the target. Hey, Angel, this guy is fine. Let me tell you. Oh. Sweet boy. My. <laughs> so what are you going to do now? Hey. I don't know. Hmm. But what's the catch though? That's the thing. Babes, there is no catch. The 300k is mine if I lose. And the 700k is mine if I win. If it were you, what would you do? You will do not me! I just want to feel you now. It's just you said. You better not lay your filthy hands on me. You uh, better not try it. You can't change up for you. Best ah, one pity you said. What pity you feel? What is it? Leave me alone now. Is it by force? Ah, yes, sir. No, the deal will go smoothly, sir. Yes, definitely. If just, just, just make sure you do your part, and I will do mine. Yes, sir. I will stay up for nine a.m. tomorrow. Oh, okay, sir. Let me let, let, let me call you right back. Let me call you right back. Leave no, me alone. Now, what is what's your problem? That's what's what's your problem? Uh, leave me alone. Now, what is it? Calm down. Leave I'm... me alone. Is it by force? Wait, wait, leave I'm... me alone. Now, what is it? Now, what is it? Huh? Can you imagine this guy just came from nowhere and just taps me on my bum? No, sir. You don't do that. I ah, see this one though. <laughs> oh, you both pepper. <laughs> no, I will change that for you. I don't screw now. See this one. Five boy chicken. Are you okay? I'm okay now. Thank you. Thanks. All right, all right. Sorry, please, can I um buy you lunch or dinner or something to thank No, thank you. No, thank you. Anytime what? you need me, anytime you need me, anytime you need me, just, just call me. Anytime you need me, just no call problem, me. No problem, no problem. Thank you. Yeah. I respect you. Uh, we'll see you. Bye, Oh my god, are you okay? Um, yeah, I'm okay. I'm sorry. I missed my step. I'm really sorry. Hold on, wait. I know you. You do? Yeah, oh. hold on. Are you stalking me? No, I'm not. Oh, you're that girl from yesterday. Yeah. Wow. Twice in one week. I think fate really wants us to meet. Unfortunately, I don't believe in fate. I'm late for work. It was nice running into you again, though. I'm telling you that this guy did not even spare me a second glance. And today is day two. Babe, can we talk about this when I get home? <sighs> maybe I'm just not his pick. Or maybe women are just not his thing. Babe, 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 babe. That 300k guy is calling me. Okay, I'll call you back. I'll call you back. I beg, don't call me. <sighs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> this is old man. Oh, aren't you like 72? Oh, you're 62. Oh, 
Sorry, young man. <laughs> I just called to check up on you. Yeah, yeah. I hope you're doing good. All right. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Yes. All right. Bye, pops. <laughs> Bye, old man. <laughs> You have officially stolen my father from me. Yes, I did. Because you didn't want him, so I took him. Oh, you abandoned your best friend. How did I abandon you? You're literally here every day, and you have a house as nice as this. <laughs> That's my father's house, not mine, bro. Ah. Mm. Then you should move out. You know, get your own place. I mean, you're 28. <sighs> bro, listen. That is not the bone of contention right now. So what is? Let me tell you. Philip. Francis. We are young men. When was the last time we had fun together, like hung out together? Francis. Your priority and mine are not the same. I don't have the luxury of hanging out. Why? You don't have money? No. So why can't you hang out? Why can't you hang out? Tell because me. I don't have time for that. And you shouldn't too. I keep telling you. <laughs> this guy, you're too serious. Okay, listen, yeah? We're young men, alright? We should have fun, bro. Alright, let's go out, let's get them girls, you know, party. Call you know, them over. Call them over. Bring them over. Bring them over here. Right. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> we are older than that now. It's time to get serious with life. Hmm? Bro, man, you're still young, man. Or oh, you want me to beg you? Alright, come on, baby, baby, please. No, don't worry, I'm good. Baby. What do they do? What do they do with all that? Baby, well, I want me to kiss you right now. You want me to kiss you? Right now? <laughs> if I punch your eyes, Chris. God, you did Chris, guy. Oh, bro. But man, on a serious note, man, I miss you. Bro. Come on, now let's hang out now. Even if it's this this Friday, come on, man. I uh, we'll do Friday. Yeah. Yeah. We'll do Friday. Yo, my nigga. Right. Yeah, you know what? I know the kind of girls you like. Mm -hmm. Anyone, trust me. I know what I mean. You can be going now, it's late. No, I'm not going anywhere. You're going to your house. Bye bye, the yeah, idea. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> not bad, <so> <laughs> Where are you going? To get water. Yeah, let's get water together. Come on, Chris, nigga. Really? <laughs> you don't say. Mm -hmm. You again? Um, please, can I call you back? All right, thank you. Hey. We meet again. Yeah, only that I have lost my excitement. Why would you be excited? Running into you. <laughs> Why should running into me make you excited? Because I cannot remember the last time I ran into a fine man more than once in the most unusual circumstances. So you think I'm fine? Mm, no, nah, I'm over <laughs> you now. Uh, I am so confused and speechless. Okay, so how do I make this simpler? Listen, I've accepted the fact that you might not be into women, so that's why Whoa, I... Whoa, who said I'm not into women? Well, you've never given me a second glance, so what did you expect <laughs> me to think? I didn't know I was meant to look. Can I look now? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh my gosh, really? <laughs> You're quite hot and you're very pretty. Thank you. Do you mind if I buy you dinner tonight? And why should I go out for dinner with you? To make up for me being so blind. Oh, so you accept that you're blind? <laughs> I accept wholeheartedly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start over. Well. Okay. Hi, I'm Philip. And I'm Angel. Do you mind if I get your number? Yeah, go ahead. All right, I'll call you. All right. Maybe it's too Okay. Turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around.
hope you have my money ready because I am bringing home the kill tonight. Oh, you better clean your ears because he's going to come home singing like a cannibal. Hello? Hi, Angel. Uh, hi. Who is this, please? It's Philip. Oh, hi. You called. I told you I would. Stay up for dinner tonight? Um... You've changed your mind? <sighs> okay, the thing is, I don't like eating out. So I don't think I can do dinner with you. Oh, you don't eat out. Are you sure you're Nigerian? <laughs> of course I am. Listen, I just prefer home-cooked meals, okay? Especially when I make them myself. Ah, that's interesting. How about we stay in instead? I could get the groceries and come to yours. Oh, no, no, no. Um, I stay with my mom. Would you like to come to mine then? I, I don't know. Um, I really don't know you. Come on. I don't bite. And I have been called a gentleman for most of my life. Plus, I haven't had anyone cook for me in such a long time. It will be great to have you around. I won't be sleeping over. Perfect. Alright then. You can send me your address and I will see you when you get off work. Tonight, trust me. What's happening tonight? Ah, Sylvia, what do you mean? What's happening tonight? You're supposed to go out tonight. Okay, it's today Friday. How do you mean it's today Friday? Yes, now it's Friday. Man, I forgot to. We have to. Let's just do it tomorrow. Let's do it tomorrow. Ah, <sighs> why are you always like this now? Let's I go out work. tonight now. I have work. I have work. Let's just do it tomorrow. I know they push me now. I'll be woman to come this house. Yeah. Baba, you woman this house. Let me see him. Nobody now. day house. Not just me. I just got some. Oh, no vex. No vex. No 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 tomorrow. Oh. Hi. Hi. Please come in. Thank you. Um, was that your friend I saw leaving? Are you okay? Yeah, 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 I'm good. Oh, please have your seat. Thank you, but I think we should just head on straight to the kitchen. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, are you gonna go dressed like this? Uh, don't you have an apron or something? <laughs> I'm a bachelor, we don't do aprons. <laughs> but I can get you a t shirt, cool? Okay, cool. Fine. Alright. One sec. Okay. I wasn't really sure which one you want, so okay. I brought both. Uh this one. This one. The, this? This one. Alright, great. Okay. Um, where can I change? Okay, there's a guest room. Right there to the left. Okay. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thank you. Um. Sorry. Could you please help me with my zipper? Your zipper? Yeah. Please. So I could easily change. Ah. 
Um, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. All done. Oh. I'm done. Oh, oh, yeah. The shirt looks good on you. Thank you. So, which way to the kitchen? Oh, okay. Just come with me. All right. Um, so, what about you to be back? Oh, we have some meals. We have to Thank you for having me. No, come on. Thank you. You made the food and it was amazing. I'm glad you liked it. I did. Cheers. Cheers. You know, you are so beautiful. <laughs> now that's my cue to leave. Why? Did I say something wrong? Not yet, but I have to leave regardless. Okay, how about I drop you? Now you can spend more time with me. I drove my mom's car, so I'll be just fine. <laughs> um, excuse me, I'll just go change. Blue is definitely your color. Thank you. Um, sorry again. Could you just please help me with my zipper? Thank you. What are you doing? Tell me to stop. Philip. Stop, Bao. Me with 700 kid in my mind. You're a bad girl. Uh huh. And so what? Listen, babe. I give it to him so that his testimony will be full, girl. Like the way he was just groaning and grabbing me. I come in face, he go come pass out. And the way he hung on to me for dear life when he wanted to release, girl. I just realized that there was this thing inside this guy that has been in me for a very long, long time. <laughs> Girl, I wish you were here so I could just describe this thing in detail for you, girl. Like, it was mad. Mad. See, guy, I did walk. But wait, though, Angel, did you use protection? No. Ha! Angel, how could you be so careless? I took pills. So what? You think it's only pregnancy you should be scared of? Now, what for you? <laughs> I beg, babe, leave that thing, I beg, I beg. We're talking about 700k here. I'll be fine. Girl, I'll be fine. I beg, I beg, I beg. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guy, the thing is that the way we met was very 
very coincidental. For guy, this girl. This girl. This girl. <laughs> this guy, he don't be. Bro, she's smart. She's a good cook. Wow. She's got a banging body. And that her body, her body is just soft, like, like freshly picked bread, loaf of bread, all those fresh ones. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Oh my god. I'm going to lie. I almost proposed on the spot. Really? I swear. Don't ah. tell me you're falling in love already. I mean, not yet, but honestly, I don't mind. I don't mind. My god. Ah. Well, I could have to know that your thing still works. It's your thing that will not work. It will work. You don't even have to do much. I mean, with the way he talked about the sex you guys had, telling him you're pregnant won't even be a shocker at all. So how long is this pregnancy charade supposed to last for? Just a few weeks. That's a very long time. Look, I need my balance now. You gave me a job and I delivered, so the deal is off. I just sent you 500k. My balance is 700k, not 500. Angela, I know. Then why did you send me 500k? Listen, I can either send you the remaining 200k right now or send you 300k after you get this thing done. No, 350. 200 as my balance and 150 for this deal. Deal. And it's only for a couple of weeks. Just, let's say three weeks. All right, Angel, listen. I want drama, okay? Come in, waste those and disappear, that's all. But wait, hold on. Like, I want to ask, what did this person do to you that has got you scheming this way? I don't pay you to ask me questions. I'm just asking. For no results, Angel. Results. Um. Yes, Ma, I've sent the money. I'm sure it's just Nego that is causing the delay. Amen. Amen. Okay, Mama, I'm, I'm expecting some more money. When I receive it, I'm going to send some more to you, okay? All right, Ma, thank you. All right, take care. Hey, Amanda. Hey. You sent some money. I'm telling you. House rent, so. The landlord is threatening to kick them out, and my brother is sick. Mm, problem do they finish. At all. Babes, how was work? My work was fine. I'm so tired. I can imagine. Mm. Eh -eh. Speaking of work, okay. let's talk to you about something. So this money, I eh, was thinking if you can use it to start up a business. Eh? Even if it's thrifts or jewelries, you can even bring it to my office for publicity. You know. And you know, you can have something doing before you get the job for yourself. Which money are you talking about? The second joke, of course. <laughs> Amanda, I'm telling you that the church is on fire and you're asking me if the pastor's beers got burnt. Babe, the money is all gone now. Angel, gone where? To my mom now. Who else? <laughs> but Angel. If anyone told me that you were this senseless, I would tell them it's a lie. Wait, 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 come, come, come. What's all this one now? Why are you insulting me? But it's not an insult, Angel. It's the truth. Okay, let's analyze this. Hmm? Do you have a job? And Sammy, do you have a job? No. And you carried 700 k that you got and spent it just like that. Instead of you to invest it and then you can spend it on whoever you want to spend later on. Wait. Was I supposed to allow them to be thrown out? Angel, that is not your responsibility. What if you did not have the money? Well, what were they going to do? Well, I am glad that I got that money. Amanda, you of all people should know that my family is my priority. 
My mother and my brother are my responsibility. They are the reason I took that gig in the first place. Okay, I understand. So how much of this money is left now? 50k. Angel, I didn't know you. What did you say? I said 50k. Ah. Angel, I'm done. They are doing you. I'm done. Oh, you, you don't need my calls, you don't need to tell my texts. What's going on? Please, how is it? Please, I'm pregnant. <laughs> I'm like, stop playing. Stop joking. I'm not joking. <laughs> stop. <laughs> stop joking now. Huh? It's too early for jokes. No, seriously, I am not joking. Wait, <laughs> I'm a bit confused. We had sex one time, three weeks ago. So how are you pregnant? And how many times does it take? I don't know. How, 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 how is this even possible that you're pregnant? How, how are you even sure the baby is mine? Of course it's your baby. How? Do you have proof? Do you have proof that that baby in there is mine? Who's pregnant? Wait, wait, wait. Whoa! Wait, she has a baby? I'm happy for you, bro. Just stop. I'm gonna be an uncle, bro. This is not a joke. Hey, it's not a joke, bro. It's a blessing. I'm happy for you, bro. I am. Francis, please excuse us. <sighs> okay, fine. I will excuse you. But hey, beautiful lady, you're welcome to the family. Okay, congrats. Francis, bro. Okay, fine. I'm out. Shout shoot that bad guy. <laughs> I'm happy for you, man. Angel, I think it's time you leave. I should leave? Please, leave. So what am I going to do about our baby? You only had sex one time. I don't know, that's on you. And that's all it takes, Philip. Angel, I don't want to get nasty with you. And I don't want to repeat myself. Please leave my house. I know that you're finding it difficult to process this, so I'll leave. But just know that I'll be back. Why can't you see? That we are two different people. Why? Then be more like him. Francis, I am not giving you a dime. Whether you shout this house down or not. I should be like him. I should be like Philip, who got a lady pregnant and chased her out of the house. What are you talking about? Oh, he didn't tell me. Why are you guys fighting? You didn't tell that? Uh, well, I was just about giving our old man the good news. Francis, what are you talking about? What is he talking about? I don't know. Oh, you don't know? Really? Or you asked her to abort it? Francis! What? Who is pregnant? Nobody. His girlfriend. Leave us. Pops! I thought we were supposed to talk about this as, as, as family. I said leave us. Pops! Pops, it was not like that. How could this happen? 
I don't know. We, we just had sex one time. That's as many times as it needs. And why didn't you use protection? I don't know. So what are you going to do now? What do you advise I do? your face like that? <sighs> My dear, it's nothing. Okay. <laughs> Wanda. Wanda. Mm -hmm. What kind of perfume did you just spray like this? Perfume? Mm -hmm. I didn't spray any perfume. How can you say you didn't spray any perfume? Because I did not spray any perfume. I just came out of the shower now. Then what is this choking smell? I beg, I don't have time oh. for this rubbish. Mm -mm. Where are you going? I'm going out for some fresh air. I can't stand this smell. Why are you calling me on the phone as if I stole your money or something? I want my balance. And I told you I would pay you, didn't I? I'm just having a minor setback in front. I don't care if there's a major setback. We had a deal. You better pay me my money or... Or what? <laughs> Angel. Or what? Will you tell Philip it was a bet to sleep with him? Or will you tell him that the pregnancy was a lie, which... Okay, fine. Go ahead. Do it. Let's see how you get your balance. Get the hell out of my phone, idiot. Hey. I thought you were on the phone. Uh, bro. Yeah, I, 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 I know everything you said. So you paid a total stranger to lure me to bed. <laughs> no, bro. Listen, that wasn't the angel I'm talking to. Okay, I'm talking. You're to unbelievable. You. No wonder you quickly broke the news to Pops. And to what end? To discredit me? Philip, relax, or let's talk about. Get out! Get out of my house now before I use my bare hands to kill you! You fucking bastard! Get out! Help me ask him all. Help me ask him why he would do something so outrageous. I did it to help you. Can you hear the rubbish he's saying? You did it, you did it to help me. He does not even look remorseful. In fact, thank you. Thank you for helping me. I don't, I don't, I don't get this. Every time Francis this, Francis that, I don't understand, bro. Can I ever do something in this house and get my accolade? Can I? But this was something I did for you, bro, as a guy, man. This was something I did for you out of my goodwill. Something I did for you, something, something that you were supposed to laugh about as, as, as guy, man. It's not something you're supposed to call family meeting for now. Because all these things now. Or is it because it's me? Really? Pops, if this were to be Philip right now, already he's a good son. He is. Pops, I have done nothing but love and treat Francis like my own brother. Because of the respect and love I have for you. 
But from today onwards, I want nothing to do with you. You're completely dead to me. To hell with you. Anything about you, I don't care about it. You can die for all I care. And Pops, why are you not saying anything about this? You don't call me Pops. It's fun. I don't understand what 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 just what see the mess you have created. You live your life carelessly without thought of how it affects anyone around you. Your brother is right. You don't deserve his love. <laughs> I don't understand what's what's going on here. What does this mean? You can figure out that for yourself. And I want you to leave my presence now and never come back. But Pops, I'm just trying to tell I you I said leave my presence before I curse you. Alright. That's, that's, that's the way it's been. What we want is Francis. It's, it's, it's a problem. I'll leave. Are you okay? You've been sleeping since I got back. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just tired. What's with that face? This is not this your irritating perfume. Oh, Angel, stop it! If you want to tell me that I'm smelling, just tell me now. No specialist, but first you're perceiving things. Now you're picking. What are you trying to say? I know you know what I'm trying to say. When last did you see your period? Last month. No, now listen. Mm -mm. I cannot be pregnant. No, I mean the last time I had sex. Well, I took the pills. I took them immediately. Okay. No, 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 it's not possible. I cannot be pregnant now. If you say so, let's go and check. No, I can't be pregnant. Oh, God. <laughs> Are you okay? Because I need my money. We had an agreement. Listen, forget about that money because you'll be getting it. I'm pregnant. <laughs> I know you are and your performance deserved an award. No, Francis, I am really pregnant. So what do you want me to do about it? I never slept with you. It's Philip's baby. You are mad. Hello? Hello? Francis! So you are really pregnant? 
That's what the PT test said, but I didn't believe it at first. So I went, I did a test, and I even did a scan, and they're all saying the same thing. Are you trying to be funny? Who? Oh. Damn. Babes, I don't know what to do. What do you mean by you don't know what to do? You're removing the baby. Eh? I can't. What do you mean by you can't? Is that even supposed to be a question? Look, Amanda, I can't. Even if I wanted to, I don't have the funds to do that. Francis refused to give me my balance. And I'll give you the funds. And how do you expect me to pay you back? Why are you trying to look for excuses? Look, Amanda, I can't. I don't want to die. Why are you being naive? I am not being naive. Can you stop being stubborn? How do you intend to take care of this baby? Last time I checked, you're living in my place. You're literally squatting with me. With no job. And now you want to bring a baby in? Huh? In case you forgot, I'll be married in two months. You'll be left alone. Rent on you. Food on you. Now a baby. Or do you intend to send the baby back to your mother? That can't even take care of herself or your brother. It's your think, think! I'm not going to do an abortion. I can't. Okay. No problem. I hope you prepare the speech that you give to your mom. Hmm? Because... Babies don't come cheap. Oh. I've said my own. I'll figure out a way. You better do that. And do it fast. Rents don't expire. Now grace with this. Oh. Just be stubborn. Did you think? my calls are responding to my text. <laughs> Does that sound familiar? I cannot do this on my own. I don't get. What are you talking about? The baby. What baby? Our baby, Philip. <laughs> You're a joker. Oh, your partner in crime didn't tell you that I found out about your stupid bets. Philip, listen, listen, I can explain. Please, please don't explain anything. Look, look. I know that this whole thing started as a bet, but like, I am really pregnant, like, I'm really serious. There is no explanation necessary. The both of you are dead to me. Philip. And to think I actually liked you. Philip, please, listen. Philip, Philip, listen, listen, please. Philip, listen, I am serious, I'm actually pregnant, okay? Please, Philip, listen. I'm begging, I am really pregnant, Philip, please don't do this to me. Philip, 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 I'm serious, okay? Philip, listen, I'm really pregnant, like, for real. Philip, I'm telling you the truth. I'm... Philip, you can't do this to me, Philip, please. Philip, listen, I'm telling you the truth, okay? I am really pregnant. I know this whole thing was, was a joke in the beginning, but now I'm really pregnant for real. And I give you congratulations. Why are you still disturbing me? Philip. Please leave. Philip, please. Please. Listen, I'm telling you the truth. I am telling you the truth. Please. Philip. Leave my house. Philip. Philip, I am telling you the truth. Philip! What's with you today? Boss, would you be mad if I kill Francis? I... I don't understand. 
Would you be angry if you, if you hear that? I killed Francis. I understand the question. But what I don't understand is why you're asking me. But you know that pregnancy thing I told you it was a bet? The lady came to my house this morning and said that it started as a bet, but now she's really pregnant with my child. Is it yours? Of course not. Yeah. Why are you bothered? Because you know my history. You know my dad abandoned me. What if this baby is mine? What am I meant to do? How am I going to abandon it to? What do I do? How did I get mixed up in all this? Philip. You are like a son to me. So, I'll always tell you the truth. I will not lead you astray. If you feel she may be telling the truth, do right by the child. But if she's not, good riddance. Remember, the choices you make are yours and yours alone. Bye, boy. Let's uh, have some fun. Don't allow this to bring you down, okay? Thanks, Bobs. Yeah, boy. Thanks, Bobs. Let's play. This is my chess. I beat you. Okay. <laughs> hey, why are you doing this to yourself? Hey, why are you punishing yourself like this? Just remove this thing and move on with your life. Amanda, I can't. I can't do it. I can't lose the life of this innocent child. Like, what if this is the only one I get? Please, forget that. See, I have somewhere that I can take you to. Hmm? Sharp, sharp. It's gone. And you move on with your life. Amanda, I've said that I cannot do it. I cannot do it. I can't. I can't do it. See, God knows I've tried. Eh? What was I've tried? And the landlord is already asking us to leave the house. He said by tomorrow he's going to pack out our stuff. And me, I've already decided to move in with my baby. And you know I can't say he should come along with me. He hasn't even married me yet. I'm already bringing someone in. I'm not even trust any other person. I'm bringing in a pregnant lady. I hope you understand. Joe, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> crying won't solve all anything. Eh? Oh, yeah. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Amanda Angel, I know you people are inside there. Huh? You think I run a charity organization, Abby? I'm giving people free, free house. No problem. I will, I will go. But when I come back, just know I'm coming with two big men that will come and throw you and everything out of this house. I will bring down this door if you don't open this door by this time tomorrow. Don't worry, you hear from me.
Francis. Uh, uh, what? Francis. What, 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 what is this now? What is the meaning of what? Where is my money? Which money? Do I know who you are? Do I know her? I don't know her. Also, oh, now you don't know me, Francis. See what you have turned me into. Just, just take a look at me. How is this my fault? Did I speak to you? So it's not your fault. It's not my fault. It's your fault if you are not coming with that stupid dare. Listen, I didn't ask you to sleep with him without protection, all right? Even if you got pregnant, don't you know what to do as a young lady? Now what for you? So Francis, that's what you're going to say to me, right? That's what you're going to say to me. You know what? No problem. It is my fault. I accept that it is my fault, but you see what? You see my money. You are going to pay my money I just, today. I just leave my you will shirt. pay my money I just today. Leave my my you will pay me today. I'm not going to let you go. You are going to pay my money today. I don't have any money to give you. To will you will pay me. I to give to you. You are even better than me. As it stands right now, I am homeless and cashless. Okay? My dad caught me off. Philip caught me off. I don't have anywhere to stay. You are even better than me. I don't have money to give to you. Please. Just maybe just look around and look for how to make money or something and take care of yourself. Francis, Francis, you have killed me. You have killed me. Now look at me. What am I going to do now? What am I going to do? Listen, Angel, I'm deeply sorry you're going through this alone. All right? I'm sorry. I wish there is something I could do to help you, but I'm suffering too. Are you sure this baby is his? What kind of stupid question is that? Of course the baby is his. Oh, you don't mind the DNA? I don't mind it. I was on my way to go see my father. I want to meet him and ask for forgiveness. I'm not promising anything though, but let me see if I can put words and tell him to tell Philip to help you. Because I cannot do anything for you right now. I don't have money on you, nothing. All right? I'm, I'm sorry, okay? You know what? Just give me give me your number. Give me your number. I, I lost your number because I had to sell my phones to, to survive. Okay, I, I'll call you. I'm deeply sorry. What are you doing here? I thought I told you never to come back here again. <sighs> Dad, I am sorry. I'm sorry for being a bad son. But I'm, I'm sorry for breaking your heart. I'm sorry for everything terrible I've done. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. I am homeless. I practically beg to survive. That I have sold everything that is mine just to just to leave, please. And whose fault is that? Mine. It's my fault that I I take full I take full responsibility. Dad, please. Get up. All I asked for is just an opportunity to make things right. I said get up. Please. 
It's not my forgiveness you need. I you know it. Please. Get up. Leave here and never show your face again. <laughs> Dad, can I ask for a favor? Francis, you are not in a position to ask for favor. I don't have any money to give to you. Daddy, it's, it, 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 it's not about me. It's, it's for Angel. The, the lady that has Philip's, Philip's child. Dad, she, she's suffering. She's going through a lot. She needs help. She, she's sweeping, sweeping one estate like that just, just, just to survive. And she also said she doesn't mind the DNA test. Where can I find her? Portmont Estate. I'm sure everyone there would know her. More like it. Have you seen your friend lately? Uh, yeah, she came to the office to ask for forgiveness. And? I told him no. After he told me that all of it was a stupid bet and to prove to you that I'm not as good as you think. Jealousy. Yeah. That means if you can't forgive him, you can't forgive her too. What are you talking about? 
the girl in question. Angel? Oh, is that her name? Well, I don't plan on forgiving her. After all, she's as guilty. My son, anger is like cancer. It eats deep until it kills you. But you are wrong. Granted. But one is your friend and brother. The other is carrying your baby. Pops, with all the respect, please, I don't want to have this conversation anymore. All right, stay here. I'll be right back. Where are you going? Let's finish the game now. What's this? I ran a DNA test. How did you get this? I took some strands off your hair and did a DNA test. I'm going to be a father. Pops, I'm going to be a father with this complete stranger. What did Francis do to me now? This is not how I planned my life. This is not how I wanted things to go now. It's not fair. What did I ever do to Francis? Really? Sometimes in life, things don't go the way we plan them. But what really matters is the choices we make when such things don't go the way we plan them. Remember what you told me when you were just 16 years old? You told me you will never be that kind of father that will abandon his own child, no matter what. So, I ask you, what choice will you make now that no matter what is staring you in the face? I'm going to work. That's 20,000 Naira. There's a hospital around here. I think the name is King Kingsview. Use Google Map or something to find it. Use that money to register for Antinatal. And if it's more than that, let me know. Do you still have my number? All right. How is she? She's okay. I haven't killed her yet, if that's why you're asking. <laughs> I never knew you were a killer. 
Are you coming around to forgiving her? No. Are you trying? Pops, can we eat in peace, please? It's open, come in. What's up? What do you mean, Good evening. Is the baby okay? The baby is fine. Alright. What are you doing? All my life, I have lived by a set of rules. Never taking any shortcuts and too scared to take risks. But this time I was desperate, Philip. I have an aged mother and a sick brother looking up to me in the city for survival. Angel, when you came here, you could see I was busy. So let me get back to this. Philip, Philip, please, I beg of you, hear me out. I know that my story does not justify my actions. Because what I did was very stupid and insensitive. If I couldn't do it, I promise you that I would. But please, this burden of guilt is too heavy for me to carry. And I'm truly, truly sorry from the bottom of my heart. So I just want to come beg you to please, please forgive me, Philip. Please. It's okay. I forgive you. I'm truly sorry, please. I'm sorry about everything. Angel, everything. I said it's okay. I'm, I'm sorry. Stand off. I'm really sorry, please. Please, I'm so sorry. home. I've been trying to call you. Um, I'm sorry, my phone has been in my bag since the hospital. Are you okay? Yeah, I am. All right. Um, please hold on. I want to show you something. I felt something. He kicked. Wait, how do you know it's a he? I can feel it in my bones. So you're a prophet now? <laughs> I just know. Right. <laughs> Thank you for this. You're welcome. Yeah. Hey, Hey. I made dinner. Ah, why? You didn't have to. It's fine. I wanted to. That's sweet. It's ready. Alright, I'll come here soon. Mm. 
This is another banger. Oh. Hmm. Now, was your cooking that became my resolve the first time you knew me? Oh, so it was the food and not the body. Which body? <laughs> <laughs> Haven't you heard that the way to a man's heart is through his stomach? Well, that means it will be very easy to have your heart. <clears throat> <clears throat> what are you doing tomorrow? Um, I have no plans. Do you mind accompanying me somewhere? Can I ask where? To see my pops. He's been dying to see you since the last time. You mean... The elderly man that took me for the DNA test. Mm -hmm. He's the closest person I have to a dad. You know, my real dad is great. I'll be honored. For real? Mm -hmm. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, bro, I'm, I'm deeply, deeply sorry, bro. Forgive me. It's okay. What's on that bridge? We're good. <laughs> I missed you, bro. Missed you too. Man. I'm sorry too. It's okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, bro, uh, this ended ended well, right? Yeah. Uh, we're having a boy. Really? You can tell already. Your father can always tell. Ain't that right, Pops? That's right, boy. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Congratulations. <laughs> 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 I'm starving. Ah, they would think I don't feed you at home now. Well, it's not my fault. The baby's always hungry. It's just like his dad. <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm glad uh, both of you are back together. It's, it's great. Uh, Angel, for the train. Dining table. All right, let's go. You were hold on. Yeah, be a gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Faz os carros da NASA. Whoa! I thought that was really one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Let's go. Ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready. How are you? How was work? I'm good. Where are you taking that to? Uh, for the baby. Oh, okay, okay. Wait. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah. Angel. Love is a feeling that you can never predict how, when, where, and with whom it happens with. It is fate and destiny at work. I never had control over the circumstances and events that led to us meeting. But if there's one thing I want to have control over, it's what happens hereafter. I want you to happen to me each and every blessed day of our lives. Angel. Will you marry me? Please. Yes. I'll get it, I'll get it. Ah. 